There are some core elements that define talent. First is empathy. Our ability to relate to each other and understand each other's feelings. Second is cre creativity. Our ability to originate new ideas, expressions, algorithms, even robots. Last, and in a way, most important, moral and ethics. Our sense of right and wrong, and our desire to be good. These are the three core pillars that define talent today. But why are these qualities not replaceable by AI? As advanced as AI algorithm is today, it wins chess masters at playing chess, defeats eSports champions at playing video games, AI does not have the ability to understand the feeling of another human being. Let me give you an example. LinkedIn's recruiter product automated a lot of the repetitive tasks a recruiter needs to do every day, such as going through thousands of resumes to find qualified candidates or going back and forth to schedule a phone interview. However, it will never replace getting to know the candidate by shaking hands, looking at their smiles, and hearing their stories. Not only AI is not there to replace a recruiter, it frees a recruiter from repetitive mundane tasks to spend more time talking to a qualified candidate getting to know one another, and offer a personal experience in the hiring process. Another example is Zillow. So about 10 years ago, actually 13 years ago, time flies, uh, I was on the original team uh, that built Zillow's flagship product called Zestimates. For those of you who are not familiar, Zestimates can tell you on every single day to all the homes that's in United States, how much your house is worth. And it is a very classic AI solution. How the algorithm is built is by collecting a massive amount of data from public records, from transactions, um, from mortgage companies, and so on and so forth. It has training data because houses are being sold on a daily basis. And it understands all the attributes about these houses. Therefore, it can predict, if you sell your house today, how much would you get? And I set a goal uh, when I was actually leading the data team there at Zillow. Um, and we set the goal to be pretty high percentage, let's just say somewhere it's around 90%. And uh, you know, after years of working there, I felt that mission accomplished. This is as good as it gets. Because I know it would never get to 100% accurate. Because how a house looks, feels, even smells, determines the last 10% of how much this house will be sold at. And that last 10% is through empathy. It is something AI will never be able to replicate. 